Hello everybody, welcome to the one year anniversary of Camelot Gaming. You have no idea how happy I am right now. I made it a whole year and I just got a lot of things to say. Firstly, I will, um, you'll notice that my voice sounds a lot more, uh, louder than usual and I'm, pro I'm, I'm worried that there's going to be some enormous feedback to it actually as I'm speaking. Uh, hopefully I'll try to bounce the audio out so your, your ears aren't being popped as we speak. But um, enough about that. Uh, th looking forward to the future. Year 2 of Camelot Gaming. What to expect now? You'll notice that I'm doing audio of... Uh, 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 recording audio over gameplay footage of uh, Counter Spy. I went ahead and replayed this game and I figured I was going to do a video of... Um, well, you know, of Counter Spy to commemorate um, my one year anniversary. You know, full circle. Counter Spy was the very first Let's Play I ever did on this channel. And then I thought to myself, you know what? Don't talk. Just record the footage. Because I got another idea. And uh, going back to that thing where my audio uh, probably sounds a little better or worse, depending on how you look at it. Um, I went back and all the footage I recorded without speaking, and obviously I turned the, the game volume down. I put it back on there, thanks to Share Factory. It's a, for some reason when you add audio commentary strictly uh, to a video after the fact, it's louder for some reason. It's clear, maybe a little bit more grating, but either way, um, because I got this new idea for a video format where I talk about whatever I can think of in the world of gaming culture, in the world of gaming development, in the world of gaming review. Anything that involves gaming, and I take my double-edged sword and bisect and dissect a particular subject cleaving it into and observing the good and bad halves of, uh, let's say, music, let's say a certain character, let's say a certain subject, uh, let's say a very specific video game, anything I could think of. Basically, that's something that's been on my mind. I, I've been wanting to talk more about certain things since I started this channel, uh, as it, especially the more I played and the more I did videos and all that. And, you know, I just wanted to get some things out there. Um, you know, just some opinions, some feelings I've had about the, where gaming has gone today and about personal experience, of course, uh, it will obviously be laced in there. I wouldn't call this professional opinion, actually. I, it, it's it's going to be a little bit biased, but, you know, I, it's it's going to be a good mix of the two. You know, I'll, I'll, let's, let's leave it at that for now, and then we'll figure out what it is later. But yeah, that's a new video type I have coming next month on a very specific date I have set in mind, and you'll guys see why. And I just can't wait. It, it's going to be awesome. Hopefully I can get some uh, guest stars on there with me. Otherwise, it's mostly just going to be me alone talking about how great uh, Ace Combat is, or something like that, something stupid like that. But I hope you guys are, uh, I hope you guys come by and see what what the fuss is all about. I I'm looking forward to it. I can't wait. It's going to be great. So I will. It'll be obviously while gameplay like this is being shown off in the background. But it'll be random games, and that's another thing. It's an excuse for me to play more of these games that I've had backlogged forever and just record. Uh, whatever I'm playing, and you know, obviously, it won't just be Counter Spy over and over. There are a couple of games might get reused, but other than that, um, there's quite a lot, and this is a good this is a good time for me to actually play those games and just hit record without having to worry about saying anything until after the fact. And that'll be a nice, good format for me. And uh, I'm calling it the double edged sword because you know that's it's the double edge, man. There, there's always a good and bad to a certain subject. And you know, obviously, we're looking for more good than bad, or we're looking for more bad than good, depending on what the subject is. And uh, I hope you guys check it out. That's all I got to say about that. Going into the future for my Let's Plays, on the other hand, obviously I'll still be doing them. I've been kind of uh, comfortable with just one or two videos a day. I know I keep saying my maximum is going to be four, but I don't think I'll, I'll be able to get to that. My personal life is getting more busy. Uh, aren't, aren't all our li more, uh, personal lives getting busy? But um, so far, I'm comfortable with the uh, um, at least attaining, uh, going, uh, uh, striving to achieve two videos a day. And basically, I'm thinking of doing the day-night thing for a while. Um, as far as updating that kind of stuff goes, there will be no more monthly updates. Not on the 28th. Anytime I have an update, it'll be based on the urgency of, oh, hey, by the way, I'm streaming on Twitch now, or, oh, hey, by the way, I can start streaming on YouTube, which is a problem I'm still trying to deal with. But um, back to the, the whole future thing, as far as um, what I'm playing is concerned, I think, um, well, there's kind of a rhyme or reason I've been uh, realizing that is a good way to go. For example, I'm going to say this right now. I am not looking forward to... I mean, I'm looking forward to playing Fallout 4. I'm no longer going to be doing a Let's Play of it. If anything, I'm going to do it for the double-edged sword. You know, it's just some gameplay footage for the background while I yap about a subject. Possibly in revel uh, relation to why I'm playing Fallout 4. But other than that, um, in my mind, the, uh, there's two reasons for not playing just the absolute newest game possible. One, everyone else already has, or is going to have, 
a uh, probably a better uh, video of that game series than uh, a, a better uh, series of let's play videos for that game than I will for one thing and I you know I gotta you gotta be able to admit that and two even if I did have better videos they're gonna get drowned out in everyone else's videos and you know I am I wouldn't say I'm trying to subscriber grab or uh, view grab or whatever but you know I do want to try and get myself out there and I want to be do it my way too I want to do it with games that I uh, think I can find more interesting of a, a topic if you will and in the, I'm not gonna say what the other game I'm gonna play instead is I do have a new alternative for the day that Fallout 4 comes out it's another game that comes out that day I'll give that as a clue but it's a game I'm really looking forward to for sure and I'm I, I had a bit of a, rev, a revelation on why I, I personally want to play this game so yeah that's another thing and the, I want to try and play games uh, you'll notice that I've been playing a lot of older games lately are games that ha uh, maybe have been out more recently but aren't brand spanking new and I kind of like that it, it, you know for one thing doing videos of new games is like um, I'm rushing towards it now there's gonna be some games where I still do that obviously like Star Wars Battlefront any Star Wars game I'm gonna be playing on the channel you could bet that any medieval based game where I'm interested enough to play it you could bet I'm gonna play that but as far as the absolute brand spanking new anything let's say Call of Duty let's say Assassin's Creed I'm not really too interested in doing that kind of thing and I think um, you guys watching completely understand that or at least um, that's what you're here for you probably understand that that's not what I'm doing at least not all the time I admit that there's some times where I'm doing it because it's a but only because it's a game I want to play and then I realize either it's a crappy game or and trudge th the rest of the way through it or because I really do enjoy the game and I think it's gonna make an interesting let's play like you'll notice I was late to the party with Dragon Age Inquisition you'll notice I was um, late to the uh, late to the party with quite a number of games because you know I'm not in a hurry because I want to create good videos. I don't want to create a rush video. And, um, uh, I lost my train of thought. Yeah, ba yeah basically, yeah. I'm no, um, as far as new video games are concerned, there will be some times I do it, a lot of times I won't. I will be continuing to do mostly, uh, uh videos of older games. Because there's a lot of older games I want to play. You know, I still, like, uh, not trying to contradict what I just said about the whole double edged sword topic, but. There are some older games that I still want to do Let's Plays of just because, man, they look like they would make great Let's Plays, like, um, Metro 2033, for example, <laughs> and, you know, I've been waiting forever to play games like that. Sleeping Dogs, that was quite the roller coaster. I'm so glad I got to finally play that game and make a Let's Play of it and share it with you, and it really bummed me out that not one, but two videos got scrubbed because of technical issues. I still don't know what happened on the second time around, the, uh, the hospital shootout, but, um, Oh well, what can you do? And that's another thing, going forward, I still have all these problems I gotta deal with. And I don't know, some of these I know how to deal with, some of these I, I'm waiting for P P PSN to update. PSN's kind of, um, whiffy, you guys know what I'm talking about, for the most part. If you guys are all P uh, PlayStation 4 owners, but it's something you gotta deal with, and I'm gonna deal with it, and I, uh, hopefully it's all fixed soon. And particularly the ability to record, um, uh, audio and party chat. There was a lot of time where I was playing Diablo 3 with Norm, if any of you guys are familiar with that Let's Play of ours. And we kind of quit because, well, you know, it was getting to the point where it's like, it's just not fun if you can't hear the other person speak. In this case, on the party chat, it doesn't allow you... Because the way the way it works, it doesn't record... It, like, you know what? We've tried all the settings, too. It does not record um, the other person's audio for some reason. Sometimes it does. Sometimes you can hear her, but it's still barely. And, and I have been kind of refraining from doing let's plays with other people not 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 entirely that reason there's some like pc experiences i'm trying to get happening with other people but it's just on my and like i said they've been making themselves available to me i haven't haven't been able to fulfill my end of the bargain bargain and i do apologize to those of you watching this who know what i'm talking about i do apologize to you guys but you know i still want to try sometime sometime in the future it, it's it'll for it, it, it's gonna be great it's gonna be fun especially i have a couple games in mind i want to do that on um so yeah, I guess that's everything I gotta say. This has been a great year for me, either way. If it sounds, if it sounded like I was getting a little urgent there, I apologize. If the audio of me speaking is horrendously loud, I apologize. I will, this is kind of the experiment, as it were. I will be experimenting with this. Um, I'll probably have the volume of the audio commentary lowered, if anything. But to make, uh, t um, it's all learning experience. It's all relevant. What I'm, what I'm talking about here, it's all relevant. Getting the kinks out of being a YouTuber, getting a, the kinks out of, you know, doing this gaming thing on the PlayStation 4, which every, I've done everything exclusively on. I really love the PlayStation 4. I've loved PlayStation since the beginning. 
I have I haven't always been called myself a big uh, Nintendo boy. You know, hold on. This is something I could talk about in my double edged sword topic. I'm gonna go ahead and say, I'm gonna go ahead and say what I was just about to talk about for that. I will see you guys all and whatever else I have next. Thank you guys all so much for watching all throughout the year. I really, really, really love your guys' feedback. I really do. Please, if you have any questions, maybe I'll even answer them in my first video. It'll be uh, November 10th is, will be my first video on the double-edged sword topic. And I will see you guys all then. Leave a like, share the video, and subscribe to get edited today. And love yourself, guys, because I freaking love you guys too. Huzzah!